welcome viewers to another episode of 40k amateur hour tonight we have a on the way to ever been gone and absent 40k amateur hour we have a special episode tonight we're trying out a new game the new age of sigmar which is kind of the 40k fantasy replacement game and tonight rico will be playing against matt and let's talk really quick about our experience pre this game rico did you ever play warhammer fantasy Yes. What was your experience with it before? Uh, when I played it, it was very box, uh, lots of rules and took forever. Kind of cumbersome, huh? Yes. All right. Now, Matt, you had some experience too, right? Or did you ever play Warhammer Fantasy? Never. Okay. You had the models because of well, Mordheim. Yeah, I have fantasy models because of Mordheim. Okay. So, Matt is playing demons here. For my 40k army. Yes. Which are completely compatible now. <laughs> Heck yeah. Every single one of them oh, have been. Rico is playing. The ones out of the box, the little storm cast with a little bit of empire. Okay. All right, and Rico is just playing to Matt the steps at the start of the game. What step are we at? Basically, the first thing we do is we roll a dice. Whoever gets the highest cuts the table in half any way they want to, as long as it's an axe. Using a chainsaw or an axe? Either one. Okay. Any way they want to. So let's roll off. I got a two. I got a five. All right, so you cut it in half. How would you like to cut it in half? Just let's go down the center. Right down the center. Okay. Okay, so we're a long way down the middle. Long way down the middle. Now, since he chose, I get to pick sides. And the mere reason that I'm standing over with all of my crap on this side, I will take this side. Okay, so a person chooses how they break the table up, the other person chooses which side they're taking, and then... And then Matt then starts placing his first unit, only one unit. Only one Now, if it's an individual model, you only place that model. Right, okay. So. Awesome. All right, we're going to pause for a minute and we'll place models and talk about where we got, what we got, well, where we're at. So he places one, we got to that. Oh, you want to show that? Then I place one. Okay, Matt places one. You know, and then he places one. Then I will place one. And whoever the first person done placing will be the person to go first. So, like, whoever has the fewest models to place Those becomes the first player. Yes. Do they so have models? It's units. So units, okay. Do they have to go first or do they have the choice of choosing who goes first? Says that person will go first. Okay, cool. So, we will go first. Yeah. So Matt just brought up a really good point. In this game, the base does not matter. Its only function is to hold the model up, which is unlike a lot of other games we played, where you measure and base everything off the base. It all is off the model. So if you have to deploy within 12 inches from the end of the board, it counts to right to the end of the tusks there. So that's an important rule of this game that... Uh, bases don't matter. You can put your mini Henrico, Henrico. however you want to. All right. Bases don't matter. Generally. Henrico, I'm done. We'll put my Lord of Change up top here. Lord of Change up in the mountains. Rico's bringing out the artillery. It's cannon time. I have to answer with my own cannon. Cannon does require line of sight in this game, so that is a little bit important. Unlike trebuchets and mortars, which don't. Well, I'll back it up with the cannon over here. Very mobile cannon, right? All right, we're gonna let him go back and forth and we'll recap in a minute. Matt, was that with your last model? Um, I got three more. Three more, okay. So let's start with let's start three more units. units. Matt is through setting up his units. So Matt, would you walk us down the line and tell us what you got? Uh, some screamers is inch, blood crushers of corn, blood letters of corn, of course we got the Lord of Change, Keeper Secrets, Pink Cores. This is the Keeper Secrets? Keeper Secrets, okay. Pink Cores is mm -hmm. inch, the Burning Chariot is inch, Skull Cannon of Corn, Seekers of Slanesh, and Flamers is inch. Okay. I hope you got that memorized, there will be a test later. Rico is set up. Rico, you want to give us a run down the line? You betcha. Uh, we have the Lord Relector there. We have a couple, a couple squads of uh, that over here. Liberators there. Liberators, okay. We have the Lord Celestant here. He is my general. And we have the Prosecutors. 
the flying guys here, and there's some over there. And then we have the Imperial Cannons, an Imperial War Wizard, and Witch Hunter. And then we have the Retributor Squad right there. Retributors. And then we have, last but not least, some Rights Guard Knights coming in as horsey. And another creepy skull face dude. Okay. John right there. All right, so who goes what way with win one? Matt is first. Mm. All right. So it is his hero phase. The hero phase basically starts off with any magic or any abilities that your heroes can do at that time. Uh, also, if your commander general guy has a command thing, he can do that now. So it's basically special ability type. Okay. A wizard. Okay, quick recap. Okay, Those little casting, guys ran up. Made for the Those guys rode up. Plus, if I cast a spell. Those guys walked up. And your. Those moved up. Space of it. You can roll the dice on a four or more. You learn the spell that I cast. He moved up. And you know for the rest of the. the they moved, they moved a little bit. Then they moved forward. And now we have what phase? So now we're in the ranged phase. So anything that can shoot is to shoot. Too much, I believe, is only going to be this. there. School of cannons. <clears throat> now, just so you know, the easy thing about this that is awesomely fun is that there's no more charts. You roll a dice for each of their attacks, mm -hmm. and it tells you automatically on their little chart, which are free, online what you need to hit so you just says hits on a four or better hits on a three or better then next to it it says wounds on and it wounds on a three or better or four or better or whatever then it may have what's called a random roll which you just minus that from the target save roll simple okay and there's two kinds of wounds in this game. There's wounds and there's mortal wounds. What's the difference, Rico? Mortal wounds cannot be saved or anything. You don't even have to roll the hit. So it just you walk up with your big axe that does a mortal wound and you just So for instance, wound these them. guys are shooties. They have 18 inch range, which makes them in there out of range. But through the pink forest can shoot. Yeah, they have magical flames. Magical flames. But your big motorcycle of doom, it shoots, huh? And my burning chariot has blowing warp flame, or bellowing warp flame. 18 inch range as well. So, since I can measure. You can measure anything in this game. At any point. Oh. If you want to. Who do I want to hit? It's actually from the front of the model, so you've got a bit of range there. Oh, I can get everyone. <laughs> hmm, what should I shoot? Let's shoot those little guys, because I kind of want him to live so we can battle it out. Okay. So. Shoot my dudes of doom. It says attack six, two hit four plus, two wound three plus. Damage is D3. Okay, so how many attacks does it have? Six. Six dice. Six dice. And it says two hit fours. Fours to hit. And three. Exactly even. Okay. And then what wound? And then it's three plus the wound. And there's two. So there's two wounds. D3 says, per wound, is there though. Anything on Rand? Uh, nope, no Rands. The damage is D3. Okay, so there's two wounds. How many does each one do? So that's one and two. So three total. Okay, so can you get this? Or is there too much of a glare? So these are the guys he's shooting. So I look right here. They save on a four or better. There was no Rand, so I just take those wounds. Here is your wounds for each person. Your movement and your bravery, which is a lot like leadership of the fort. And that's everything you need, no more big long stat lines or anything, it's all right there. So three wounds. Three wounds. So I got saves of four or better. So I take one wound, and they have two each. So one is just wounded. This guy is wounded. Now, on wounds, you can actually pick whatever model you want to take the wounds. However, you have to distribute them all to the same guy until he is dead. So you so I can't say one, 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 one. So I can actually pick the guy in the back. It's just easier so I don't have to move other guys. It's actually strategy because I want them closer for the charge. So I'm actually going to kill this guy off first because he's the furthest back. So he has one more. Makes sense. Okay. All right. So you're done shooting. So that takes us to what phase now? No, I'm not done shooting. Oh, not done shooting. Oh, yeah, he's got a skull cannon. Yeah, I got more shooting. So at the end of the shooting phase, I'm going to be rolling a dice 
For each unit that suffered wounds from the Exalted Flame or Drilling War Flame, on a four or more that unit suffers additional D3 mortal wounds, the mutating flames refuse to die. On roll one, the Zinch's physical nature reveals itself, and in one model in that unit heals D3 wounds instead. <laughs> These guys have the exact same thing, actually. 18 inch um, attacks two instead, or three instead of six. 18 inch range. Watch. Even puts this back guy in. So they're gonna be shooting as well. Shoot my horses? Dude, we want to do horse versus horse. Uh, he, want, he, he wants you to do fewer horses versus his horses. Oh, I get it now. He wants cavalry. He wants you to have calver. Which one? Okay, attack three. Except for the exalted, has four. He's a prior caster. Exact same thing. Three, one, two. Two hits. Four. Two wound, three. Damage D3. Four to hit. Threes to wound. You know, the funny thing is that was a 100% 50-50 roll again, just like last. Just half, huh? And they're all wounding. <laughs> How many wounds per? D3. D3 per die, okay. So that's three, Ow. six, nine, ten, eleven total. Woo! Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yep. No okay. end. Four of saves, and with their shields, I get to reroll any ones. Good thing because I rolled lots of ones. That's a little better. Six, six wounds. Six wounds. Ouch. That's devastating. Three guys die. Wait, Rico, doesn't that flag give you a benefit? Oh, yes, thank you. You don't want to kill the flag guy. Kill the flag guy. <laughs> no, I do not want to kill my flag guy. And I don't want to kill my commander, so he's still on. All right. All right. Well, thank you for as that. long as you can choose which ones to pull. You can choose, and I chose poorly. All right. Are we ready to make our run rolls? So, one last shooting, which is One this more guy. shot. Okay. And this is Bernie Skull. Range 30 inches, attacks 1, 2 hit 3, wound to 3. Rends negative 2 and damages d6. Now, if the unit I'm shooting at contains 10 or more models, I add plus 1 to hit. Nice. I'm going to shoot at your cannon. With my cannon. Okay. Uh, check range, we should be good, but I think you're fine. You always just measure. Yep. We are definitely good. 30's right here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, need a three. It hits, and it's negative two to Ren, and it is, uh, well, the wound. Let me roll the wound first. I almost forget. Three plus the wound. Wounds? <laughs> yeah, wounds. Negative two to Ren, and it's a D6. So it's one. <laughs> one hit. To negative, negative two to run. Okay. I don't think he's gonna be able to do much with this. It wasn't too bad. So it could have been nastier. Could have been nastier. Oh, he does. He gets to save on right. six. Woohoo! Oh. So the cannon has a wound. Now again, the cannon and the cannon the staff, the crew. Individuals. So I can. He since he shot the cannon, I have to put it on the cannon. Okay. So now I'm going to use the uh, Warp Flame ability, obviously, since it's the end of the shooting phase. All right? Yeah, the shooting phase. So I'm going to roll against them. If I roll four or more, that gives us an additional D3. If I roll a one, mortal wounds. Mortal wounds. Now if I roll a one, he's going to heal D3 instead. So, oh. nope, nothing there. And then against the cavalry here, nothing there. So, a whole lot of nothing going on. That's good. Okay. Now you declare any charges. Uh, the like. rule was within 12 inches, you can attempt to charge. So, we can, I can attempt to do a horse charge if I really want to. Uh, over here, the flamers, as you can see, not much they can do. They're just kind of out. And over here, we're going to be in the same front. Close, but same boat. Might as well attempt a horse charge. All right. Okay. I'm going to shoot Overwatch. There is no Overwatch there in this. No Overwatch. Oh. So, so six, and I'm allowed to move that distance. What do you need to make it? Pretty much a 12. It's not going to be easy. You only have to get within half inch yep, of so the other you unit. You have to only be within well, half inch. Let's see what my tongue is. <laughs> All right. We'll go from. Then, there we go. To my tongue is nine and a half inches. So, so you only need nine. nine. So I need to roll a nine. 
Let me see if they have a special ability when they're charging. Because you don't have to be able to touch the base like in yeah, faces means nothing. So you have to just end up within half inch of the other model. So as, as Chad and I found as we were doing a test game on this, you move all of your models when they're sticking out like this, this way, so this can get closer to the end. However, it can be detrimental when they shoot at you and you're like this because now you're closer to them. But so add one to all charge and run rolls for this unit if it's within 12 inches of any demon or heroes from your army, which is not. So that really is not going to help me at all. So try to get a 9 and a 2d6, and I do not. I just not. So nothing happens. Nothing happens. Now, you are completely done, so what we do is we now need to roll what we call the battle shock thing. Any unit that had suffered wounds now rolls. Each unit has a bravery. What you do is you roll one dice, adding the amount of figures that ran. For whatever you have above your bravery, that many models run, not the whole unit. So you add the dice roll plus the number of wounds taken. So these guys lost nobody, so they're okay. They just lost a wound, but nobody died. They lost three. So there. Bravery is seven. So I roll a dice and I add three to it. I'll re -roll Inconclusive. That. Roll low, Rico. So that is a seven, and since I'm at a seven, nobody runs. Now let's just say I have rolled a six. That would be nine. So that'd be two over, so two of those guys would have ran. Which is actually awesome, I think. So instead of losing a whole unit, the whole unit is yeah. something chicken out and take off. Yeah. A few dessert, not everybody. Yes. <laughs> Okay. So we're done for this? So you're done with that? It's sir. Rico's movement phase. We'll let him move everything up and be back in just a minute. The first thing I'm going to do actually is not move it because it's hero. hero. Oh, that's right. Hero. I'm, I stand corrected. Okay. He stands. So the first thing, he is going to use his command ability. Uh, any storm cast uh, eternal unit within 24 inches of him does uh, not. Let's see. Does not have to take a battle shock test uh, if they're within 24 inches of that. Does that apply late? So at the end of the round, we've got gotcha. 24 inches. He's going to do it now. So any of these guys within 24 inches of him at the end will not have to take a battle shock test. Also, we are calling upon our Relector. Let's see if he is in with range right now. Because he can do a lightning <laughs> So, is this magic? Are you doing magic? No. All right. This is, this is a ability. supernatural ability. Oh. <laughs> Not to be confused with magic. Not to be confused with magic because magic can be dispelled, right? And yes. This is anybody within 12 of him. So, no, cannot hit in this guy. He definitely has nobody with him. These guys remind me of chaplains in 40k. So, those dudes don't get to do their special coolness. And I don't have the other guy because we didn't have enough. So, that was my hero phase. Now we shall go. Oh, and magic. Do your dance. Do your happy dance. He is going to cast a spell. Do your happy dance! Heck yeah, I can cast a spell. <laughs> so he's going to cast a spell. How hard is it to cast this spell, Rico? I will show you how you cast a spell. With my Empire Wizard of Doom, which I must find here real quick. It's under D for Doom. Empire Battle Wizard of Doom. Let's not forget. He has his awesome chain lightning. However, there is no builds around him, but he is going to cast chain lightning. Chain lightning, what you do is it has a casting value that they tell you what it is. This is a casting value of six. I roll two dice. If I get a six or higher, the spell goes off. However, if he has a wizard that is within 18 inches of my wizard, which he does, he can then also say, I would like to counterspell that basically. He rolls two dice. If his roll is higher than mine, my spell goes in. So his wizard can cancel your spell. And I can fizzle, yes. So I need a six for my chain lightning to go off. And it goes off. I'm going to attempt to counterspell this. So he is going to try to counterspell. So I need to roll a nine, right? Or bigger. Come on, Zinch. That's not a nine. That's a seven. That's a seven. So my chain lightning hits that model. Zinch is very thick. Uh, so he takes D3 mortal wounds. Ooh, no saves allowed. So D3 mortal wounds. He takes three, three. mortal wounds. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> huh? Matt didn't laugh quite as loudly as you did. <laughs> 
calls. Matt is making funny noises. So, D3, how many did I take? So you take three mortal wounds. Three! Three mortal wounds! Oh. Now, mortal wounds are nasty, as we say, because there's no saves. I actually rolled to see if the spell went off, but if you actually have a weapon that says it causes mortal wounds, it says in the rules, you do not need to roll to hit or wound. You just go and go, you die. <laughs> okay. Mortal wounds. Mortal wounds. But there are things that save against mortal wounds. So, very few. The cool thing is this guy's a spell spell thief, so if, if any unbinding roll, which I assume is the D spell, is a nine or more, I instantly steal that spell. Now, I was just going to tell you that, because you are within the range of this wizard tower, you could choose to roll. On a four or better, you learn that spell I just cast, and you know the rest of the game. On a one, two, or three, you take a moral <laughs> Ooh, would you like to learn a new spell? Would you like to try? Yeah! <laughs> and I learned it! You now know, chain lightning. <laughs> Write that on your character sheet and smoke it. Oh, nice. I would have laughed if we were taking mortal wounds, but that is awesome. Just for clarification, there are certain pieces of terrain in this game that provide certain benefits or... What's the opposite benefits? Uh, Deficits. 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 Yeah, Detriments. Negativities. Yeah. Cons. Now, during movement, you cannot move within three inches. So if you get within three inches, basically the only way you you can fail a charge is by rolling a snake eyes double two. So stay away from my tongue. I'm gonna lick you. All right, we're gonna let Rico move up, and then we'll recap in a minute because he's got a lot of models. He knows how to run a camera here. Okay, okay. So they the knights moved up. The storm oh, just so you know. dudes pause for moved up. Pause for a second. Pause for a second. Uh, let's see pause. Anyway. Okay. Sorry, sorry. That was a minor Your, your angels there. flew up here. Yes. Retributors. Retributors. Ret Advanced. Cannons held still. Cannons can move four inches. Let me turn that way. Okay. And yeah. Yeah. Your big boss moved up next to him, big dude. His, yes. But his warlord's over there, who's not a warlord, is a general. general. His general, okay. Your general went up there. To fight his wizard. Okay. And my wizard did zap him. I, we got that, right? Right. Okay. All right, so we're going to do our shooting phase now. So... Let's do it. 40 inches, so... I think you got him. I think I got him. So he's going to shoot. They shoot two. And they hit on fours. Now, the cannons, it depends on how many crew are there, it actually tells you how many shots it takes. The fewer crew it has, the less it can move, and the less, less it can, it can fire. fire. Because the crew de determines all that on it. So it gets to shoot two shots right now at the flaming thing, which I don't like at all. It hits both of them. Bad we go. And it wounds on twos. So that's the thing. Wow. All right, so that's both of those. And that one does D3? It does more than one, yes. I do believe it does. Here we go. Uh, D6 damage. D6 per dice. This could be a lot of damaging. If Rico quits dropping his dice. Alright, and it does... 6. Yeah, that could be worse. Six Do you have a save against that? Is there any rend? There is a rend. There is a rend, oh. The rend is negative 2. So my save is... was a 5. It's now... It now be a 7, which you can do. You can do. So it takes... And now it's dead. First blood so it doesn't matter. There is no first blood. But oh. back into the war. Just so you know, that was that was pretty lucky. I, when I played against my son, my cannons never <laughs> the entire game. All right, this cannon is going to try to shoot your skull, guys. and it hits only once. No. It's on fours. Does see? There you go. Does not even hit. Woohoo! So it missed. Blah blah blah. My cannon is still. This alive. cannon is shooting this guy up here. Okay. It hit both times. 
And it wounds. Oh, wow, box cards. That could have been awesome right there. <laughs> and the wounds are nine. Nine wounds from a cannon. Nine wounds. All right, this is going to suck. Because. Minus two rent. I can easily die. My save is four. Minus two rent. Sixes. Sixes. And I save several of them. Three. You take. So I take six. Seven, eight, nine. I got one left. Ooh. Okay. Those cannons are brutal. They are. Yeah, your flaming theme wasn't pretty either. <laughs> Just so you know. Oh, no, I'm not saying it was. All right, I'm going to throw some celestial hammers at you from these guys. It's, hey Rico, is it hammer time? Dun, 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 Can't touch dun. this. <laughs> okay, so I'm throwing out your flying lamprey, lamp lampreys, and we uh, hit on twos. Or, I mean, sorry, two attacks. Hit on fours, wound on fours. So that's six attacks. Okay, hitting and wounding on fours. Do this. Now, my one dude though gets an extra attack because he is the the uh, That's what sergeants do. What is he called? Persecutor a uh, prosecutor prime. Sergeant. Oh, he only gets that in melee though. Sorry, so he does not get an extra attack. No. Only in melee. Do this. Alright, fours and fours. So half. And Two. Um, two. Uh, F. Okay. Is there any rain to those guys? There is no rain. Okay. Five plus two wounds. I got a five plus save on these plant rays, and I take two wounds. Uh, they have three wounds apiece. All right. Now these guys. These guys are chucking their hammers. <laughs> So same thing. Fours and fours. We're shooting your chicks on weird horses. <laughs> chicks on weird horses. It's a song, isn't it? Again. Chicks and on weird horses. One. 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 Let me see what their save is, if any. Five. Five plus. And they make it. Save. <laughs> I color coded my dice to the god. I get one. The pistol hits on nine inches, so I do not think I have range. No, I do not. So that is my shooting phase. Shooting's over. Let's do this. I now are declaring shooters. I think these guys will charge there. All right, let's do this. Five inches. Overwatch. I'm no, just not Overwatch. <laughs> So yes. I think you're good. We are good. <laughs> horsey versus horsey. I don't know if those are horses I'm saying. They're demon horses. <laughs> Let's see. Just because it's a demon horse doesn't mean it's not a horse. And they ride, oh. This is Trent. He's a wealth of information. That punch poison tongues. Was that again? Just because it's not a horse doesn't mean it's not a horse. Just because it's a demon horse doesn't mean it's not a horse. Words to live by. Chad, what? I was telling Matt right now, every time I attack you with my, my cavalry units, I want you to know something. You're always getting my two cents worth. There you go. Okay. I'm also declaring a charge here. Alright. He's the one. Wow, 11? I think he made that. He's making it. Okay. Now, here's the cool thing now that we are in two different combats. So, so you know, since it was my turn, I picked the combat that I would like to do first. So I could say, I'd like to do this one, or I could say, I'd like to do this one. However, then after I attack with the one unit, Matt gets to pick which one he'd like to do. He could counter the same one I pick, or he could say, ah, those guys are screwed. I'm going to try to kill his leader and do that one. That's not going to get any worse, so maybe I can kill off him before he attacks me. Right. Cool. So you can actually then, then you alternate back and forth until every unit has attacked. Picking who you want to do. Neat. So, to attack, I am going to choose this one first. And I am going to then you get a three inch pile in. 
And range does count on your weapons. It does tell you a range on your weapons. Bottle to bottles. So you you will have that. All right, so I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven guys still there. Then your sergeant gives you something, right? Did you get yes. extra attack or something? And I actually, my flag gave me something as well. So my standard bearer for the Rice Guard Knights, I only have to take a battle shock if two or more models are slain during that turn. So that's good to have here. Uh, the charging lance, I add one to all my wound rolls and damage rolls for their charge this turn. So I have... Seekers can run and charge in the same turn. One attack with these. Five, six, Seven. So these will actually hit on twos this round because of my charge. And then my horsey foot hooves need to hit on fours. So two, one, two. Now, typically in situations like this, you want to attack, attack with your short range weapon first, see what the losses are, and hope that your long range weapon can still reach people to kill. Again. Okay. Here we go. So twos on the white and fours on the blue. Or, yes, opposite. Twos on the blues. Fours. And Joe came in. To the this is Joanne. She does not want to be on camera. I'll talk to the editor okay. about that. I'm not an editor. Three's on the blues. Make sure she's like in everything. What are we? We're not editors. We're producers. Three's on blues, the blues, four's on the white. And the actors. I'm the, I'm the lily cameraman. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there is no rend. Six saves, right? Yep, six saves. Okay, five pluses for the saves here. And I save three, so I take three wounds. Uh, my guys have two wounds apiece. Is it closest model, Rico? Nope, you can take any model you want from hi -ya! And then one will have one wound. Which is awesome because you don't have to take these guys. You can just take the ones in the back and... Okay, now you choose. Actually, yeah, I'll take. <laughs> and then give a wound to one more because that'd be the next one that would die. Very stupid. It attracts everybody's attention. All right. Okay. What is it? King Titan's Bill. All right, so we're going to go over here to this guy. You can choose where you want to count. More than likely, my guy's going to die before he can counter if you attack. So I'm going to attack with my guy over here. That's why it's like here or here? That's right on. Do some damage before he dies. Yeah, he has one left. So you might as well hurt me. All right. So let's scroll back up to the Lord of Change. Now he's going to have staff is edge, damage table four plus, breaks in talent two, final hit with more. Claw claw bite. So he has a staff is edge and curd beak and winged talents. So you attack with everything that he has. Okay. So attack for the staff is inch is two attacks and the wing and talons it has a star. Which will tell you basically probably how many wounds he has or whatever. Special rules. So you guys have damage fun. table. Yep. See you later, man. Okay, so I need to get stuff done two before Gladiator Games Friday. Okay, so two and two games. So I'll be rolling these separately since they have a little bit different profiles. Now since he's hurt, he's doing a lot less damage. Since he's a little Is that how it works with him? Okay, yep. So here's the staff is it. Really? I don't. And I need fours to hit. I'm coming up with lists. And I got one hit. Oh, And two wound. So is four. I didn't change at all. Nope. No wound. No wound on the staff. Okay, now I'm gonna do uh, beaks and talons. So it's two attacks, two hits, four, and two wounds is three. Negative one brand, and damage is one. So that'd be two hits. Three's to wound. Two wounds. Two wounds. It is negative one to brand, and damage is one. So two wounds with negative one to brand. Okay, I need fours. Save both. Darn. 
the space brain. He's got three up save. All right. That's it for me. Okay. Yeah, I'll take that. There we go. I choose my next battle since I only have this one. I will attack with the Lord Slustient. I will do his. I will do his Temptus Hammer, which has three attacks, and then the Dracul's Claws and Fangs, which also have three attacks. They hit on threes. That wasn't very good. Ouch. And these wound on twos from the Temptus Hammer. So there are two wounds at negative one rand, and they do D3 damage each. So that's one, two, three. Three damage. Three damage. I need one to rinse. I need fives. Gotta make them all. And I don't make any. <laughs> I think the model is exiting the board. Suck back into the warp. Oh, that's okay. That is pretty awesome. All right. So my turn is done. Therefore, we now do another test. You lost one guy there. And I did not lose. Oh, no, wait. You still have to attack with them. Yes, I do. I am sorry. Come back. You are good. I am sorry. So, yes, please do your attack. I was just waiting, you know, waiting for you to realize that. But we're good. Okay. <laughs> just jump on me and say, <laughs> no. Okay, so they each get four attacks except for him. He gets five attacks. Yikes. You need to make sure they are within range, so I'll do a three inch pile up. Okay. So I would him here. Yeah. Pull that one there. Okay. Yeah, you know, those guys are with the yeah, sure. here. Okay. Oh my lord. This is way too many dice, Rico. There's gonna be a lot. There's probably a five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine times four. Thirty-six plus one extra. Thirty-seven dice. What do you think? Two. Uh, here's 16. Hit on fours. Every, well, I need to roll these separately. So we need half of those. Because half of the horses and half of them, right? Um, yeah. Yeah, one, one's have rent. <laughs> so grab your reds or something and use them as the other. Yeah, I'm going to have to. 16. What did we say the number was? 49. 36, 37. Which one get? Uh, four. And there's two nine. For, two for the horse and two for them. So 18 for each color. That's right. Except for 19 for, 19 for the cloth. Two, four. So, charging time. 19. Into the claws. Four is the hit, four is the wound, and they go one to ran. That wasn't so good. Wow, that's a lot of That's a lot of whiff. Whoa. That is a lot of whiff. Wow. Okay. So, let's go for horses. <laughs> for buses, that was way below statistics. But hey, we don't play. See, unlike Rico, I can't roll dice correctly. <laughs> I don't know, I didn't do too much damage to you in charge. <laughs> okay, so these are going to be four to wound, and these are the eight one to rinse. They got no damage apiece. And so, two to eight one to rinse, okay. And the rest is four to wound as well, it's just normal. So two to rinse. Four, two and two. Two normal, two rinse, huh? Alright, so all those dice and we get, we went up with four wounds. Wow. That's a lot of... Okay, they are four plus, so the negative ones, I need fives. The negative ones will be the whites. So I need fives, fives and fours. Yeah! So, two saves and two nons. That is enough to kill a guy off. So he does. Alright, now, now we're done. So, what is your leadership? Uh, my bravery is ten. Or bravery, yes. And bravery. My bravery is seven. So I lost one guy. I lost one guy. And I got a six. And I got a four. So you have five. So you don't need to lose and end up losing anybody. Else. Nobody runs off the board, huh? Well, All right. Reality blinks so you can get them back. <laughs> Roll ones. Okay, now here is the cool thing. 
guess. Here's what we do now since the turn is yeah, really over. Initiative. We roll initiative. And we see who goes. Oh, I got a one. I got a four. I think you go. I like killed my uh, four. Well, I was rolling a finesse die. It makes sense. For a this could be bad or good because you could end up with two in a row. Or you could end up with me now suffering through more death. So Matt gets to go now. All right, let's take a look at my key to awesome command ability. <laughs> Oh, Too bad no one's within. We're not within both. <laughs> if I went it off, they would be able to pile it twice and attack twice. Whoa. Nasty. Yeah, pretty good. Um, so right now, next is going to be magic. Um, as far as a magic user is concerned, I am only down to. Killed the chariot. Killed, the Killed him. So the magic user is in him. <laughs> Not too bad. Won't help me out any at all, though. <laughs> so then, what happens next? Move? Yeah. Let me, let me see my dark temptation here. Kind of, yeah. Actually, okay, I'll be during uh, his. Okay, I'll be during his. I'm gonna move him. All right, so we're gonna pause while Matt moves. Okay. He broke it again. All right. So these guys meet up a little more over here. Now your manta rays are jumping the hill. Yeah. Coming after his general. As did your general. So we will soon have general versus general. It's the hope. All right. Oh, and mana rays for some reason. <laughs> Why not? I'm scared of my general. Peak whores moved up. The mobile cannon of doom moved up. And the icky riders of doom are still engaged in combat. And the little flamer thing jumped over up there. as well. Nasty. Okay. So we're going to start shooting with the skull cannon of corn. Why not? Okay. Attack one to hit three to wound three. Red negative two d6 damage. Shooting your cannon, of course. All right. But I do not like it. It hits. It wounds. <laughs> and it does inconclusive damage. It does five. Uh, at a negative. So is it d3 or d6? D6. D6. So it does five at a negative two to end. <laughs> oh, don't save any of those. Shots return. Shots return. Damn. So is it broken down? Now does the cannon extra death splash over to the soldiers manning the cannon? Because it is a complete unit. <laughs> that is a good question. Because it's all a unit. You can't take them separately. Yeah. You don't buy the cannon separate of the men. You have to buy the right. men and the cannon together. One time, one is challenge now. All right. Um, yeah, it's gone. Uh, Where okay. so, I don't want to have one. They already did. So already so I don't want to have to roll that many yeah, dice yeah, right now. All right, consult the book. I'm hoping the challenge. Inseparable. So. Yeah, it makes sense that it's sure. units of the, the wounds would splash over. So it finishes off the cannon and takes how many dudes? Okay. And uh, those two dudes are saying, oh, suck. So, like, uh, Moving on. What are you shooting next? Ah. I think they said more than, oh, suck. <laughs> Am I within flamage range? For some of them, you are. Yeah. He can only see that guy. We do true line of sight, don't we? Yes, we do. And he got some. Okay. So all the three guys. I'm going to be flaming. So it'll be seven. So this isn't as bad as the other one. There's not a persistent warp fire that stays behind. It's just a, burning over, huh? It's just a four-four, one damage, four to hit, four to wound, one damage, one shot apiece. Um, so only two hits. It's okay. And two wounds. Two wounds. I mean, eggs on their ends. No eggs on their ends. Okay. So they are the <laughs> liberators. They got four up saves. So four Those are the Storm Castle Libertarians. <laughs> one save and one wound. So this guy is dead. 
do they have? I'm going to put that there so I remember they've taken a wound and we'll need to take a test. Alright. Over here because you can't shoot into combat. No, anybody who's a green no. dice? No. Nope. Thanks for asking though. Shoot over here. Uh, warp flame into combat because you can. Yes, you can. You can shoot in and out of combat. 3 3 4 tap. Well, 4 3 3. And you don't even need to shoot the person you're attacking. <laughs> this is true. You can be in hand-to-hand -hand combat. This is true. Okay, so I need four to hit and three to wound. D3 with the remaining you know, fire effect at the end of the shooting phase. All right. Very effective. Three is the wound. Three is the wound. And see, this is where not so I effective. do... Yeah, not as effective, but not terrible. So these each do D3. So three... And two, two. Seven total? Seven. Three. Mm -hmm. yep. So seven. Seven total. And Seize. negative on Rams? No, no, ne no negatives on Rams. Okay. So. Five, six, seven. seven. That's my horses, right? That's your horses. I rather like those guys. <laughs> are. Burner Boys. <laughs> Burner Boys! Four saves, and they can reroll one because of their shields. No one, so they're much. So that's three. So one more dies. And one takes a wound. Uh, I believe that is the end of my shooting phase. Okay. So I'm going to do its uh, residual effect at the end. And it's a six. Ooh. So you're going to suffer D3 mortal wounds, which is two. So that's going to stay there, and another guy is going to croak over the board. Three, right? Yeah, and I rolled. I did only. Yeah, yeah. So you did three. Yeah. Okay. No, I did two more. Two more wounds. Two more. Yeah, because it was D3. D3. Yeah, so one dies. Yeah, that's true. One more wound kills a guy. But you're gonna have to finish killing this guy before you kill another one. I did. Yeah. It did two. They have two, so it killed the one. And the one. Yeah. So it would have killed the same either way. If you want me to, I'll just put him. It would have worked out exactly the same. But that's your flag man. You don't want him to die. I know. <laughs> Rico, I don't care, Rico. You're good. But we're good. Well, Rico's trying to say it. It doesn't matter. It works out the same. It works out. He dies. <laughs> you're saying if, you, if, if the first wound you allocate goes to your flag guy, he's going to be the first one to die. You don't have your flag guy. I agree with so you. So my flag guy doesn't do much now. don't kill your flag guy. Because I'm losing more than one. I don't have to take a thing unless more than one guy, two or more guys die. And two or more guys die. Okay, so uh, let's do some charging. The uh, land phrase screams his inch into your hero. And I roll a three. Three. You almost didn't make it. <laughs> you almost didn't make it. Because a two will not make a charge. Nom, 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 nom. All right, keep your secrets. Um, I mean, re-roll, wound rolls of one. Okay, cool, awesome. Nothing really special else. Well, let's do this. Let's see what I need. Again, measuring from model to model, not base to base, because... It's like five bases, and a half, so I need a five. Bases, hold up the model. I think you I got it. Hello. Did you make your deranged, dangerous terrain check? Oh wait, this has simple rules. Yep, I passed it. <laughs> <laughs> Roll the one. I still passed it. Okay, so now I get to resolve, figure out which one we want to do first, right? So we have, I think we have three comments, right? One, two, three, yep. Him. Okay. Because he's cool. So. Um, he has ranger sharp claws and an elegant great blade, and he will re-roll failed uh, rolls of wound of one. Okay. Um, if he misses or just if he misses? If he rolls a one. If I roll the one, the wound, oh. I re-roll that. Okay. So I haven't suffered any wounds, so my attack for my ranger sharp claws is six. You get six attacks with your ranger sharp claws. Yep. One can be zero. And my hit is three. So three. So three on that guy. Here's a wound. The wound is a three at negative two rand, two Ow. damage. Or negative one rand, two damage. So that's four. Four at negative one. Four at negative one. So I need, I need four. Oh! Oh! 
<laughs> Make that five at negative one. Six, actually. There. So is that two, re yeah. Yeah, two for one? Thank you, Joe. <laughs> First time playing, I forget these. Uh, I need things. fours. So he suffers three wounds. <laughs> and then my other great blade gets two attacks, three to hit, and two wound will be two. Negative two to Ren and D3. Threes and twos. So one? Yes, I do. None. Sure. You got lucky there. Okay. All right. They've suffered one wound, these guys. Yes. How many wounds did they take? Two, well, no. Three the two wound models? Three. They suffered two. Oh, so one left. I am. I am gonna have to go here, and I can distribute my attacks however I see fit. But I think I am going after these guys because they have not attacked yet. Finish the mana rays before they hurt you, huh? Try to take out the mana rays. Yeah, they, uh, they have three attacks apiece. I'm not worried about that, but that's the way. Okay, so. Don't get anything cool because I didn't do the charges turn. So I get just my attacks. These are my Temptus Hammer. And these are my Claws and Fangs. We hit on threes. And then white, we hit on twos. Blues, we hit on threes. Yeah. So in each one, that's. White is a D3, so two, so that's five at negative one rand. So I need sixes. Five. And I made two sixes, so I will take three, which will kill one of them. Kill one of them. Works out the same in the end. <laughs> Crap! But you have to finish killing the... Okay. I'm gonna yeah. come over here next. Yeah. There. Right. <laughs> there, Chad. There. All right. So let me go back to these guys. Uh, same thing. These are the claws. And I need fours and fours. <laughs> See, when I roll lots of dice at once, I don't still do that. And force. And we have a single inconclusive. So that would be four negative one. Four at negative one. Yep. Alright, come on, guys. What am I doing? I'm trying to grab all too many dice. I'll try red this time. Blood for the blood guts. Finish them. And these would just be normal. Four. Just in Jagged Vine, Ultimate Demise, not very rich. So normal? Yes. <laughs> Ignore the lump what? on my throat. Fours. Okay. But I live in it's just an extra head. <laughs> I'm hoping it's just my burn expanding. There you go. Okay, six. Six more? Six normals. Six normals. Take your normal saves. Right, come on, buddy. I need some saves. Uh oh. Not looking good for the horse mounted. And they're done. All gone. They're all gone. The demon steeds and the flamers took them out. And the Reich's Guard fall. Okay, you don't have any more to do. Here, no, no, but I just want to point out a rule since we're filming this. This is an interesting thing. Uh, since the combat is going, I am done with anybody because they can't counter anything, but if you have range, anybody, even if they weren't in a charge, can still attack. So if this guy's attack range would actually still be able to hit him, I could claim individual attacks and say, well, these two guys are going to attack. Right, if you had like a two, two had two whatever the range was, yeah. yeah. So that's kind of, they're not, and I was just measuring to see if they could be, because even though they weren't charged or anything, anybody that's in range of their weapon, you're in the range of my hammer, I'm still engage, yeah. <laughs> you can be, so. They were not, so I am not able to attack. So yes, brings up really cool. Movement. I am done. Like, so yeah, you have to be careful. Finish off my 
awesome dude. I don't know about finish him off. Finish him. Finish him. All right, let me get back to these screen. Three attacks apiece. I got two guys left. Wow. They need four's a hit, three's the wound, a damage one. Maybe not. They're not a monster, so they don't get anything special. Okay. Oh, wow, now that's some hit. Four's the hit. That makes up for your last one. Well, it doesn't matter in the end, does it? Whoa. 50%. Well, about, yeah. Three. Three. And any rends? Nope. Three's up. Kidding me. Right. Two more. Two more down. Okay. I believe that would be it. So we need to roll. Well, they are already dead, so they're good. They're not going to run. They're dead. He can't run away because he's a single model. So your lamprey dude, they did lose two. So they run. And then these guys need to roll. I lost two. Is it per wound or per guy's lost? Per guy lost. So I lost one guy. Okay. And if their leadership is it's 10, then you can't run away. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's These demon, we're all dead. <laughs> These guys lost one guy. And they're fine. So that would be four. And my, or my seekers didn't lose any. This turn. Okay. Now it's yours. Devastatingly sad to me. Okay. So, this is what we are going to do. Payback. Are you going to do your hero things or are you going to move? Thing first. Hero thing. So, first thing is he is going to attempt to call down his lightning storm on those guys. No! Chain lightning. No, this isn't chain lightning. This is. Oh, this really? Is lightning storm. In my hero phase, I can declare the Lord Rector is going to pray for lightning. Well, usually we pray for rain. He's praying for lightning. I pick an any model within 12 inches, roll a dice on a three or more, they suffer D3 mortal wounds. So, and you must subtract one from all your hit rolls on your next phase. So, he is going to try to shake the ground. You can't and those are the blood pressures? Yep. Okay. Uh, three or more. There is lightning. And is this not magic, is it? No. Dang it. It is a heavenly prayer. It's a supernatural so ability. Except for two mortal wounds. Yeah, four apiece. Okay. He is going to also summon lightning on so your wound, chicks. You, know, you can't roll again? No, unless you have a special ability that lets you save versus mortal wounds. Which, uh, his which prayer went unheard. Mortal. Sigmar didn't was not listening. No, it is not there. Hey, you reached the Sigmar hotline. <laughs> Please leave a message right. and we'll call you in the morning. He is zapping this bro with some chain lightning. So I need a six. <laughs> this guy's going with some chain. Alright. I made now, it. Barely can Matt counter it. Yes! He can! Oh, he canceled the spell. Over. Okay. Now, Matt, would you like to roll to see if he learns that spell? Yeah. Or take a mortal wound? Oh. I take a mortal wound. Ooh. A mortal wound. It was a risk. It was worth it. I can't even learn that spell. All right. So that is magic. Isn't that so much faster than psychic? Psychic phase and everything in the 40k love. Okay. That is all done, so I am going to go to my movement and then shooty phase. We're going to lose Rico. He's going to soon have the Age of Sigmar channel. <laughs> be within three inches of you, which I already am. So these guys are just going to move. Oh! Uh -huh. Alright, we're going to kill the camera for the movement phase and let Rico get done. That's all he can do. You could do what, Rico? I could actually, one of the cool things is there is a retreat, so I could actually, anybody that's in hand-to-hand -hand combat, you can just automatically just pull them out of hand-to-hand -hand combat. Now, there's a vantage to that if he moved out here, they can't do anything else, all they do is, so if he would have moved here, say I move these guys up here to kind of do a block or whatever, but I'm going to bet my odds and I'm going to try to keep him in combat. So you could bring him back and then kind of make a, a line of these guys yeah, to stop so you from... I could have, on my movement, retreated him. Uh -huh. And then brought these other guys up. Nope, they just can retreat. That is a movement. But once they retreat, they cannot shoot. They cannot do anything else that charge or anything else. They just back off. Huh? Back off. All right. So we are shooting now. Yay, shooting! So we're gonna do a cannon at 
This guy here. Of course, why not? Which cannon's shooting where? This cannon is shooting. All right. Well, no, this cannon's going to shoot him because that's going to try to shoot the cannon of Colin. God! So he's going to shoot there. And no, he's that cannon is not hit anything yet. So this cannon's shooting the cannon of Colin. And it hits once. And it wounds. And it does. One. One wound. One whopping wound. Negative two wins. See, I told you my cannons had one Negative ground. two, that'd be a six. And don't. Do not save. <laughs> I will take the wound. You'll take the wound. All right. My awesome chuckers of, of hammers for chucking hammers to these guys. Not very well, but they're going to attempt to. Okay. Attempt what? Impressive. These guys are chucking hammers down onto the big riders of corn dudes here. Now they know how to chuck some hammers. These guys are hammer chuckers. And they do. Uh, well, they checked them, but they only do two wounds. <laughs> two wounds. Is there any, uh... I do not believe that these guys do any randage with their chucked hammers. Okay, I got four claws. And I make both unless they do have a red. No, they do not. Okay, so I make both. Okay. That is that. I'm just throwing these guys away so they don't get lost. Okay. I'm sorry. Moving over here, shooting, 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 shooting. All right, I've got two gunshots. Which hunter? Which hunter? He is shooting. He has two Barak pistols. And he's shooting a demon. Doesn't that give him a bonus? Shooting a demon, which gives him a bonus. He does not like demons. Witch hunters like to shoot demons and magic users. I get one attack, hitting on three is winning on three. But, However, if it is a demon. But the demon, the demon works white it out. Yeah. Yes, it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's a demon. Uh, if I attack a demon, but I do D3 happen? wounds instead of just one. All right. So I hit on threes and I wound on threes. So I hit one. And I three. Got it. Now roll D three wounds. It's two wounds and negative one rend. So I need five. And I don't. I take two wounds. Okay. One of them already has two. Yeah. Can I kill him? Yeah. You will kill him. Although in theory I could put it on a different guy, right? No. You have to, once you start killing with someone, you have to so finish him. It follows the pit. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. You have to kill the guy off before you go in. And this. Team Sure, this demon hunter does not have which one does not have range, so that is my shooty McShooter phase. Alright. All right. This is charging time. And now declaring some charges. My first charge is going to be these guys into those guys. Then I will have So you just shoot and then charge you? Yep. Then you make Four it. They make it. Rawr. Rawr. Yes, they rar. Grr. Hey, rar means rar. I love you in That's right. Rar, rar, rar. And Rico is putting his base on top of the other base because bases don't, don't, don't count. count. <laughs> sure don't. <laughs> What'd you say? Because it's all about that base. All about the base. All right. These guys are attempting to charge there. Oh wait, they ran, they cannot. Never mind. Gotta be quick. And we'll charge him next turn. Yes, it will. <laughs> I ran and it's like, awesome, that, wait a minute, that's not as cool. Down close These guys are charging there. And they may or may not like me. Four inches. So are they four and a half inch or closer? As long as they get... Yeah, oh, they're there. They made it within a half inch. More exciting now. Okay, and he is going to attempt to charge. And he's easily in there. And they don't have weight And they're there. And they don't want to charge them. Is that nasty? So I think that is our charges. Oh wait, he was going to attempt to charge in there as well. He's good. 
So he charges it in his range. Now, if if you're really clever, wouldn't you put him like this, so his his streaming banners are closer there? Uh -huh. He has, has better range. Yeah. Now he's definitely within range. Yeah. Of his it's all about the hammer. the streaming, streaming banners hammer. next to the horsey tail. That's right. Good call, Chad. Because it is not the base. It is the, the model. Model. That would be the model. Okay. I Let's shall pick my first attack. Take him next time on the movement phase and turn him all sideways so you're out of range. <laughs> <laughs> I think... Those guys are just nasty. They're going to beat me in life anyway. Do it where you want, Rico. Do it now. He is going to attack him. Done. All right. So your general is attacking his general. My general is attacking. This is what we call general you combat. This is, a, this is a general battle. <laughs> it's a general okay. really beat you. Whites and blues hit on threes right now. Rocking the Smurf colors. That's not very good. Yeah, he's got a hit there. Whites going on twos and blues going on threes. So two, and then the white is actually D three. So two, two. So a total of three and two of them. Oh, both of them. So all three of them negative one on random. So fives. Three on negative one. Take two. All right. So make him now in his less effective tier. All right. Well, I gotta now figure out where I want to go. Let's do some blood crusher awesomeness. All right. Get your three-inch pile in. <laughs> now, since there are two units on you, you can distribute your hit against those two any way that you yeah, want. I'm just gonna attack them. Okay. I'm boring that way. Keeping it simple. So I got one attack with the Hellblade and three with Juggernaut's Brazen Hoose. And I will make two attacks with the leader instead of one with the Hellblade. And any hit to roll of a six or more, <laughs> I'll fix the mortal wound is set. On a Hellblade. Alright, so he, these are the Hellblades, four is the hit. Oh. Two oh, mortal geez. wounds. <laughs> and then uh, the wound, nothing there. So two mortal wounds so far. Two mortal wounds. And then here's the hoofs, the D threes and threes. And these guys are very corny. Uh, wow. One. One. One? Yeah. One normal save and then two mortal wounds. Yeah, that's the way the fifty crumble. Alright. Two mortal wounds fall upon this poor man right here. And it's like I wasn't even up there. One normal save? Normal save. Four up. Yeah, guy decides Dead. to die. So, big Terminator dude with hammer eyes. Okay. Woohoo! Terminator down! So. They're done, so we're okay there. So, we're actually come here. And we're gonna attack with our little dudes onto your horsey peeps. Horsey peeps! So. Our liberators. See, I'm not remembering their stats. Get. Uh, do they have more than five wounds each? Two apiece. Two apiece. So I don't get a cool thing. So I think I'm gonna fire this. But I do get to reroll ones on my for my shields. So we have two attacks plus my climb gets three. So that is two, four, seven, eight, two, ten, twelve. Because they're gonna do a three-inch pile. And you're good. I don't care. Okay. Here in three inch power line. So, well, so 13 attacks. Oh, I'm, I'm learning not to care about things that just don't matter. <laughs> in this game, there's a lot of the things that just kind of don't matter. In a silly game like Age of Sigmar, it doesn't matter. All right. So we hit on fours, wound on threes. Hit on fours, wound on threes. That yeah, wasn't so bad. So awesome. But, uh, Oh, okay, it's a lot worse than I thought. Yeah, that's pretty sad. <laughs> it looked a lot better from my when I first looked. So three. 
three. Is there any rams on that? No rams. Okay. Five up. And I will take two, which will kill one and pass the wound to one. There you go, Chad. Well done, Matt. I, I did it the uh, correct he, way. Matt did it right. All right. Because we need to set a good example right. for our viewers. One, two, finish. All right, I need my crushers. I need my keeper. I need my lamp for the... Uh, might as well do that. I think they're mocking me. So, three-inch pile, right? Yeah, it's definitely mocking. Yeah, <laughs> I can't be the pirate breaking the rules. I'll be no, Chad and I'm follow really the rules. Sad, you know, well, if you had your pirate patch on, you could say they're that. not really. If I was still wearing, if I was still wearing the eye patch, that means I was probably losing my eye. So I'm glad I'm not wearing the eye patch anymore. Too, but I didn't get to enjoy you as pirate man, Chad. <laughs> I lost another guy. In fact, these would be the tones. They really dice? Yeah, that's what it's half the tax your tongue. He's gonna lick you. Tongues have dice? Poisonous tongues, Joe. What does that remind me of? Oh, Panscots. Panscots. So far, three normals. I think it comes in dice. Oh, that too. So far, three normals. Three normals. Okay. We are still alive. These are the claws. The claws, the demon claws. Now, felt the hits of the claws. I reroll once. So it still fails. It really wanted to fail. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. And these are negative ones. Negative ones. So five, negative one, and three. Not. Three normal. Okay. And I can reroll any ones. Awesome. That was a good. So, the negative ones. We fell, and then we make all that. So two. That's not so bad. That wasn't too bad at all. So he picked crux over this. You were like enticing him. Which means we're one and one in that combat, Rico. Yeah, one and one in that combat. All right. Uh, so your pick. My turn. I am going to do a three-inch piling in with my big Terminator guys with axes and come in on your corn guys. Okay. Now my, or I guess they're not axes or hammers. My Richard Futures. Cool thing about them is I'm going to hit. If I actually roll a six to hit, it does a lightning hammer attack. It shoots out lightning and does two mortal wounds instead of its normal damage. I don't have to roll damage after that. So two attacks each plus one for the prime. So that's two, four, six, eight, ten. That's eleven attacks. And those guys are obviously the better than the Joe Schmoes. <laughs> hit on threes and wound on threes. Ooh, there are three sixes. So that right there will be four, six. two for six mortal wounds. And then these wound on threes. So there's that, and these actually do two damage. That's two for six at negative one rand and three mortal wounds. Okay, so the six mortal wounds. Six mortal wounds. Oh, six, six mortal wounds. That's so right. six mortal wounds will kill one and leave two is left on one of them. It's fine, whoever you want to kill. I want to take the non painted one. So now I need to roll five up, because we're going to save his four. And he needs to pass six of those. He needs to pass all but one. So I saved them, but I'll take three wounds. You only had two left, so he's gonna die. He dies. Those mortal wounds are just vicious. Oh, that is bad. Right. I rolled a lot. Three sections, that was awesome. That was awesome. The crushers are high. All right, now we got a whole bunch of blood letters coming our way. Normally I am All right. That is your turn to pick. My turn to pick. Done. Uh, I'm glad I did the crushers already. Let's do the keeper then. Keeper, that's your general, right? Yeah, that is the general. Alright, let's go back to his chart. Sure. Oh yeah, because he's wounded, so he's not as awesome anymore, huh? Okay, so his attacks is going to be five this time instead of six. That's with his claws, he still has two for his sword. And his wounding will change out his sword by one as well. Okay. So here's the claws. I'm good, thanks. 
Okay, uh, threes and threes? Threes and threes. You're way too nice. Threes and I'll hit. The king and one. There's a 16. And these do two damage at negative one or end? Two damage. So that's eight. And negative one. Eight at negative one? Yep. And this is him, right? Yep. So I use three turns. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> I don't have to make my other attacks. Just out of curiosity, hit, hit. Three's the wound. My wound. General is down. Two at negative two. Which does not give you slay the world. So who had first blood, though? Does it matter? Who had first blood? I did. Just... So you have first blood. Now he's got slay the warlord. <laughs> who will have line breaker? Time will tell. I'm gonna fly my guys over. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty much her right there. For the new watchers, that's a 40k um, thing. So just last. So what's left besides your big guy over here? Yeah, but he didn't. He doesn't have to be attacked anymore. So yeah, go to. That's what it is, exactly. They are. Skull faced guy with a bunch of decorations. Yeah. Three Chaplain. Threes and threes, and they're negative one ran. The only thing I don't like about them is their faces. Threes. They need normal helmets. So, one at negative one ran. Six up, and down. Uh, yeah. There's souls stuck in some sort of, sort of celestial construct. They don't need faces. All right, all right. So I lost two guys right there. So you're still fine, Mr. Is that the right one? Joe, you are awesome. So yeah, Thanks. thank I you. I rolled a six out of a ten. I'm okay. So you're okay. Joe provides me with food and drink. <laughs> no. and I, your guys? I am not eating my reserves. <sighs> you lost one. They lost one. And I believe there's. Yes. You open candy like a girl. <gasps> so, <laughs> I didn't say that was bad. Thank you. As far as I know, you only lost one, right? Yeah, no, there's six. So if I roll a six, one of them will run. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so close. And I actually lost one of those guys. And they are seven. So we're good. Okay. Now is technically initiative. Right? Yes. Four. 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 How many rounds do you play? Five. Two. Dang it. Woohoo. Uh, <laughs> <twice. laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think you go to the wipe somebody off the table. Oh. So it's not like more time where you're going after somebody around? Nope. This one pretty much goes to. Uh, <laughs> I'm like, what's German name? Yes. <laughs> what are you just thinking? Oh, by the way, Matt? Yeah? Yep. Yeah. Yep, yeah, we gotta play Firefly one of these days. Okay, sounds good. I think you'll really like it. It's a good board game. We should film it and put it on Freaking Arc. We're playing Firefly. It really is. Alright. So, since I don't really got anything to build a cat against you, I'm gonna catch Arcane Bolt. Him. <laughs> now, if I remember right, arcane bolt is the clue value of five. Is this magic? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna try to counter it. Ooh. Met makes it with the nine. Big numbers, baby. Big numbers. counters with oh, a seven. Close. It goes okay. off. So it goes off. Eighteen inches. You pick the D three mortal wounds. Yeah. One. Because <laughs> that wasn't so bad, Rico. <laughs> <laughs> Did you always do the back guy? <laughs> uh huh. All right. My movement phase now? All right. Look, pause for the movement phase. Okay. All right. So we'll do the skull kid in the corner. And, uh, mm -hmm. I don't like these guys. I just want to shoot them point blank. It sounds fun. Can you fun. throw your hammer? These guys can. He misses. Ouch. You hit me what? Skull cannon misses. Oh! He was shooting right here. <laughs> it was too close. Oh, it was too close! <laughs> Bounced off my shield. <laughs> You're not gonna shoot all the stinking uh, other dudes. Yeah, I didn't have time to arm. So, okay. Now we got Flamer. Uh, it's the pink horrors. Pink horrors. Pink horrors of Zitch. Four fours. There's ten of them. Perfect. Force to hit, force to wound. Force, force. Nothing special. They probably do. Nope, not unless I have lots of pink wars, which I don't. Ow. Ow, there's some ones. 
Ooh. I had to say that's more Zinch saying. <laughs> uh, that's wow, not a thing. Not a thing. That's them laughing at you because you're pink. So, yeah. yeah. It should be blue. Well, if you kill one, they're supposed to turn into two blue ones. Never in Dark Heresy when you were fighting right. them. Every time you'd kill one. They... Flamers. Yeah, troops, might as well. You could shoot those other guys. They're all the same unit, aren't they? All oh, these ones right here. Oh! Shoot your own guys, yeah, sure. But no, I'm gonna shoot your guys. Alright. Uh, yeah. oh, okay. What do we have? Right. Yeah. Fours and threes. Those chicks on this weird lizard thing are nasty. I they're actually a lot better in this game than they are in, than they are in the 40k. They die way too quick in 40k. I, say, hey, I haven't been able to kill them hardly at all. It's because 40k is all about shooting, where this game... Yeah, shooting is... It's cool, but... It's not necessarily... Threes! <laughs> These are D3s. So, one, one, two, and two. Six total wounds. Six total wounds of any rending? Nope. All right. Dude, rending doesn't mean the same thing as it normally does. Like no. No, it's apart. just negative one to your arm. No, just, oh, okay. Just, usually one or so two. I haven't seen anybody turn apart yet. So. Well, you saw my guys die pretty heinously. Yeah, but that's nothing. Yeah, this sucks, man. <laughs> This game is about loss. Just embrace the loss. Yeah. If he was surrounded by yeah. He got licked. He did. Yeah. Was not good. Yeah. The poison tongue got one of them. And yeah. then... So that would be my shooting. So let's go ahead and do some assaulting here. Um, no assaulting. Have the keeper attempt to. I'm sure you need uh, Might as well have the blood thrown attempt to. Ooh. <laughs> it barely does that. I did move it three. <laughs> I moved it right to three inches. <laughs> Anything but snake eyes then. Do I want the horrors to go? Yep. Four and a half inches. Well. That unit is not doing well. They're plugging up the valley there until they die. Oh, I know. All right, letters. Oh, oh there they're doing good. Those guys are doing good. No, what? Yeah, so I rolled a whopping hit. three for the blood letters. The cannons hit. The cannons. Hit. Fortunately, I did measure, so I will get a few guys in here. That was a pretty terrible roll on my part. The fact that I've lost initiative every round has not been good for me. Alright, uh, let's try with the lampreys. No. Might as well, right? So it's been hurting me. And that's a five and a three. We have an eight. All right. All charges have been declared. All right. Who would you like to assault you first? All right. Hey. Okay. See ya. Okay. See ya. Bye, Joe. Thank you. Welcome. Thanks for the drink. Okay. Attacks five. Two hit. Three. The wound three. Okay. And I only got two hits. Uh, rune rolls, I will re-roll. These aren't two wounds, so I'm not going to do that. So, two wounds. Now, they are negative one. They do two damage, so that's four at negative one. Four at negative one. Yep. The other two is one. And it is a three. And does not. Does nothing? The other one does not. Nope, my sword does not. I rolled a two. Needed to roll a three. All right, go. All right, I'm actually gonna attack these guys onto your letters. Blood letters. And let's see if anything special about them. I don't really look at them really. They are going to move the three inches. Okay. Massive blood letter armies are apparently awesome. Massive anythings are awesome in this game. That's why I'm trying to get more archers. Because <laughs> the benefits of having 40 archers is so much better than 10. Well, yeah, once I reach 20, I add plus one to hit. 
And I, you know, I have that amount of blood letters. Come on. It's not running. And now you understand why I'm looking for archers. All right, so there's four mortal wounds. Oh. Dang, sixes. And two, four, six, at negative normal, at negative one. What I mean, one, sorry. Six? Six at negative one, and four more This is kind of rough for my blood. Maybe I should have talked with them first. What my bad. What letters have? Save what? Five. So, so you six. need sixes. And I save two. All right. And then, so four, four plus five, six, four. Seven, eight. Eight. Eight of them died. Alright. Everybody at the flag, man? No, there's two left. Oh, okay. two left. Uh. Let go of the table. We don't want to die! I just want to get sucked back in. Punished by Lord Horn. This guy's just right. screwed. What else do I want to do now? These guys are awesome. Oh, yeah, they are. I should have attacked them. Uh, are those your liberators? Yes, they are. No, they are the uh, retributors. Retributors. They are um, nasty. I like them. I definitely like them. Yeah, they're, they're good. Uh, liberators are just kind of troop troops. They're average shows. Yeah, they're space marines. These dudes. Pretty wicked. Mm. No, those are monsters. It's your veteran squad. That's alright. Okay. They're going to attack. What's his style? He's not all that fantastic. He's a chaplain. Uh, five wounds to shoot that lightning on the zero phase and three up save. Same thing with the weapon skill. And he attacks four times. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Uh, fours and threes. That's all right. Okay. Two. Two. Any rams? Nope. Three. Oh, I did one. Yeah. Got him once. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I was. If you're a monster, I do a lot more damage. But I, know, I got a couple things that got monsters too. And I'm like, hey. No, no, not that. Oh, yeah, I had a monster. Uh, that would be your pick now. Wow. Um, so this is my blue board. Well, go for it. We're going to do our three inch pile in here. That dude's already attacked them, huh? Yeah. Well, that means we'll get an attack on my turn. So we're going to do here. Sweet. You're good. He's stuck on the big pincher. Alright. So they're going to go. Crazy claws. So they're going to attack the pink horrors. Horrors it is. So, two attacks. He gets three. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Okay, and fours and threes. Fours and threes and fours and threes. Fours and threes, fours and threes, fours and threes, fours and threes. So, against fours and threes. Wow. Three. Three wounds. At any specials or anything? Uh, they only have, they don't have more than five wounds, right? No, nope. no. Nope. All right, one dice. Well, yep, one dice. Wow. That was not as cool as that hope. My turn! Okay. <laughs> you know what I'm going to do. Because now the only attacks you have left are with them and them. Or him. So, three inch pile. Get those tongues in there. Uh, no, you gotta stay here. No movie. Okay. He's got a lot of licking to do. Awesome. Another one. Alright. Get the tongues. Fours and fours. Oh, oh yeah. 
Four. So far. And now the piercing clothes. Mm -hmm. Pitcher claws. Okay. One dice extra because of the extra attack. Because my leader's still in there. And you can tell which one he is. That was pretty bad. Two hits. No, and it only six. Okay. Yeah, that was a mess. So four more. Four. There's normals. Those are a negative one. Four and four. Four and negative one. Four and negative one. Four and normal. Four and negative one. Four and normal. Negative ones. Normals. <laughs> Go with the fence, guy. I know you want to stay there. You like my blood letters. Yeah. Ah, bloody letters. Okay. All right. Your turn. Six attacks. Well, that's a pick. We still got two guys here. You got him over here. We got updated. Um, okay. <laughs> What's your screen? We're gonna do um, the lamp break. Okay. What's our screen? Right. <laughs> <laughs> threes and threes and negative one to red. Yeah. Yeah. So three and negative one, one to red. On the lamp breeze. So we need sixes, it's inconclusive. Okay. That will definitely zap one right away. Uh, Is it one of those already has a wound on it? Got so. Yeah, right. Alright. Your turn, Matt. Alright. So so they do my letters. So they do these, this. Them. Might as well do the letters, I guess. All right, blood letters. Hit chart. Kind of like these blood pressures. It's on four. Let's go. So you basically roll a six or more, that blood inflicts a mortal wound instead of natural damage. Sever my head. Point the hit. I only get two attacks. My champion is not in there. So one. And the wound's a three, so normal. So one? One, normal. Does one damage. Alright, these guys. We gotta get these guys. Four ups. We miss. <laughs> wound is taken. Take your wound. I say it's open. Alright. Here we go. Okay. Alright, so I need to get this one out of So they are done. So this dude will attack. The chick on the horse. Chick on the horse. There's a lizard. What? The chick on the horse, that's a lizard. <laughs> Alright. So, uh, threes and threes. <laughs> so, one, negative one. So, six up. And I will take one. That was pathetically sad. Woundage. Uh, Damn, chicks are hard to kill. Yeah, they're surprisingly doing really good. I like them. All right, um, so they've attacked. I've attacked over there. The only guys left are these two right here. Um, since I'm already in corn section, I might as well do the skull cannon the corn. So that's uh, hill blades. Um, one inch range though. So I don't know how you want to call that since they're in the back. Man, they, they models can't move, so I would say they're corn. Okay. I mean, they're stuck on it. Yeah. you want to peel them off. <laughs> the model itself is within range, so... Oh. So, the gnashing maw, which is the front thing, is... Uh, basically, if the skull cannon uh, causes any wounds in combat phase, at the end of the phase, you may make a burning skull attack as though we're sh your shooting phase. You basically just shoot your cannon. Oh, cool, awesome. So the Hellblades, it's those attacks. Just have the decapitating blow, four is the hit, three is the wound. 
One hit. One wound. <laughs> and then I was hoping for sixes right there because those are the decapitated blows. <laughs> no such luck. <laughs> Very good. And gnashing maw. So I need a four to hit mm -hmm. and three to wound. Nope. Although that ran for the hellblades is that negative one. So negative one four? Save. Yep. One save negative one. I can reroll one. That is not a one. But sadly, that is not what I need. So is anybody taking a wound yet? No. Doesn't look like it. So we got a wound. Okay, anything left? Don't you have him left? Yes. He attacks. Fours and fours. No, he doesn't. No. All right, so the thing I left have is the horrors, so we'll make our three-inch pile in. Pink horrors! These guys aren't so good at attacking, so don't don't fret too much. Uh, I don't think these two guys are in range to attack, right? It's gonna be the same... what? One? Yeah, I think they're one, actually, for their range. Let me look. Probably not. But you can go from the very tip of their claw. <laughs> I'm not terribly worried about it. No, I passed them. Pink horse. One. Yep. Five is a hit. Four is a wound. I'll call them out. So that should be eight. Two, four, six, eight. <laughs> One hit. And no wound. <laughs> wow. There you go. That wasn't so scary. <laughs> Yikes. All right. Uh, I think that's it. Okay, right? so now we take our runny check. Yeah. I got lost eight over there. Was there a Your ramp parade dude lost one base. These guys lost. Just that one wound. That guy. They lost four. So at 40 roll. Five, six, so they're good. Right he does six. not run. Wow. So I need to look at my blood letters over there because they lost eight. They lost eight. And they're ten. Look all demons. I need to roll two. Or one. One would be better. Two. Two. <laughs> oh, he's good. One would, I mean, I would D6 back of them back, but okay. Um, anywhere else lost? To the little You're one. D6 of them come back. Because the banner. Oh, yeah. The does They're all wandering. It's all about the rag and the stick, huh? Okay. Oh. Okay. That's it. So my turn. Yeah. I am doing my hero phase. He is going to pray for lightning to come down on those guys. Oh, I like the. That is an inconclusive prayer. Yes, the lightning comes down. It deals D3 mortal wounds on that squad. So, two. two mortal wounds upon that squad. Two mortal wounds on that squad. Well, bam. They bam. have two. All right. Stan, he is going to call lightning down upon that guy. Oh, please be lightning. No, prayer went up. No lightning for you. And this dude is going to see if he is just in magical range of awesomely zapping this. And he is. So he attempts his chain lightning. And you're going to try to stop me. <laughs> stop me. Big numbers. Yes. Boxcars, beat that. Bam. I hold a nine, which is, or yeah. Chain lightning goes off. Now that is awesome because I can actually hit more of the bad guys around me. So. Because it chains. And your, old, and your own guys, maybe. Chain lightning has a casting base. Okay. Uh, suffers D3 more wounds and roll attacks for every other enemy within six inches of the original target. They also suffer D3 mortal wounds on a roll of a six. Yeah. Well, so it would be ten guys in the... Uh, so right here, this guy suffers one, three, and this guy here, and it... Ooh, yeah, it hits! And it does three, three mortal, mortal wounds. wounds. That's three sixes in a row. And... You're running out of sixes die, uh, to roll. And on this thing... Nope. Nope. Does not do... Anything on there. Brutal! Still Ouch. impressive. Ouch! Very out from my keeper. That was awesome. That was not okay. <laughs> Alright! Now we're over there and kill that guy now. Now we're going to move. Walk over and kill your stupid caster, Rico, because that lightning is brutal. I wish I had chain lightning. 
Okay, as Rico moves, we'll cancel the camera and come back in a minute. First shooting phase. Just like that, movement is done. Shooting phase. These guys are chucking their hammers. At who? At the at your general. The evil general. Yeah. So did you say anything else? So, hits. And two wounds on him. Normal saves. It's fine. We're up. And man, we gotta get rid of those. We're throwing at the horsey chicks again. That's a lot of hammers. Good hit in there. Yeah, they throw both of them, and some reason they come back. That's three wounds on the horsey. They trade with Thor, huh? And I will take two wounds. Finally, they're starting to die. Okay. Mr. Cannon McCanner is going to shoot Ugly Man here. No! And he misses, so Cannon McCanner guy shoots him there. And he hits once. Dang it. And he wounds. Dang it. And he wounds one. One at a negative two rand. Negative two? Yeah. Nope. Take it. Does that kill him off? No. Dang it. I couldn't. I can see those cannons. Oh, I need to hit with them cannons. That sucks. Okay. He's a hurting though. Uh, the witch hunter is definitely not near as effective. Him. Yeah, he's he's hurting pretty bad now. How many has he got left? Uh, three. Wow. He's a, what was he at the beginning? Ten. Okay. He's Where's just like the other guy too. That you. Zapped to death. Threes and threes and negative one to ram. So he is shooting his D3 wounds because you are a demon. Both hits. Wounds. And they're D3s. So that three. is three negative one rims. On him? Yep. And I take two. One wound left. And that, I believe, is my shield. Yeah, he only moves six face. inches now. He went from, uh, in this turn, he went from a 12 inch move to a six inch. Wow. Okay. He is, uh, He's hurting. We are now going to charge. So he is going to charge. And he makes it. He doesn't need to. They are going to try to charge. I don't think they make it. Boost. They have the drop there? Oh, good. They're flying. Flying go straight, huh? They make it. They ignore terrain. They're flyers. And this is the turn where I get devastated finally. I doubt it. Cannons could have done some awesomeness there, but did not come your, through. Your lightning did the awesome. Yes, I did do some of the chain lightning. All right, we are now in hand-to-hand -hand -hand combat, so I am going to choose my attack. My first attack is my Birdman on your dude. Going for the general. Of course, that's the smart move. So my prosecutors. And your melee get two attacks, threes and threes. And the main guy gets an extra attack. So it's two, four, six, seven. Two, four, six, seven, threes and threes. That's a lot of ones. <laughs> Don't get to re-roll those, do you? A lot of ones. Um, I can re-roll hits of ones on this unit. Thank you for that, Chad. Well, that's still a lot of ones. <laughs> <laughs> But you get to reroll once. But you gotta reroll it. But you wanted to reroll a reroll. Uh. And one friggin' hit. One hit or one That was wound. awesome. My wound. Alright, any negative Durand or anything? <laughs> no. Alright. Pretty frickin' sick. And he's fine! Woohoo! That was sick. He saves. <laughs> Well, I better attack with him before he dies. So, uh, oh, I'll attack your bourbon. Why not? All right, go for it. So this is what sucks now. He only has two attacks with his claws. That's pretty bad. Threes and conclusive. Two hits. two hits with the claws. The wound is threes. 
one, and that's negative one. That's two damage. Two damage, so two. And add negative one. Negative one, so I need freaking sixes. Not just six. No, actually, need five. That's freaking six. Oh, freaking five. Freaking five. That'd be freaking more ones. That's not good. Now it's the end of the cycle. Erk. There is. Okay, Angel. That's all right. Okay, great sword. Two. The hit, fortunately. The wound, though, I need four. And I got an inconclusive. And I got one. And then it says a D3 at negative two. So two at negative two. Two at negative two, now I need sixes. No. Wow. Angel down. All right, that's him. He's done. Finish him. Or ignore him. One of the other. We actually want this guy to steal that, because that's actually my sergeant. Sergeant. I can't tell apart, but then I looked down. Oh, wait, he's got bigger wings. <laughs> that means he's the sergeant. All right. All right. Angel, your turn. <sighs> Suck. <laughs> he has one wound left. I know. All right. <laughs> he's gonna die. He doesn't we are have gonna put, shot, he's gonna die. We're gonna put three of these guys on him, okay. and these two guys on the pink horse. All right. So sergeant's on the horse. Sergeant's another guy on the horse. One, two, three guys on the main chief. So horse and horse. Um, well, only two guys hit horse, and only one guy hit the big dude. <laughs> and only one wound on the pink horse. You're kidding me. On the horse? Pink. That's it. Only one wound on the pink horse. That's all I got. And he saves. <laughs> that saves the six. Was ridiculously sad. Uh, wow. so it's my combat phase now. Oh. <laughs> let's, let's talk about those two blood letters over there. Alright. Fours and threes. Okay, two. And one. One. Okay. No rendage? Nope. Oh! How many wounds do they have? Two. They have three. Three. Okay. That's right. They're the big terminator yeah. guys. All right. Your turn. <laughs> okay, they're done. So we're coming over here. He is attacking the Hersey Chips. Threes and threes. Oh my gosh! This is not going One. away. And you're in? I don't know. I don't know. Yes, negative one round on him. Six up. Down. Okay. Uh, my turn? Yep. And I'll swing one against one guy against him and the rest against him. So here is the tongue of the steed. Inclusive. That's a miss to hit. No, okay. I was trying to have a special ability and I forgot what it was. Let's see if it wounds. Nope, no wounds. Okay, here are the claws. And one hit of the claws. And I need to make another attack with the claws because I rolled a six. six yeah. And nope. And it's one wound. No niggas? No, well, that claws at negative one. Negative one. Arrgh. It's a wound. Okay, the steed's on the other one. Hit. One wound with uh, normal. Sixes and not a single six and one hit and no wounds. <laughs> that was a whole lot of. Nothing. Go! Okay. So they're done, they're done. You haven't attacked the Zenith, you haven't there yet. So, yeah, or the other guy over here. I'm gonna go this guy against your Okay. Alright. Ooh, I'll hit. And three wounds at negative one. On the lamprey. No, he makes two. <laughs> he takes one. Holy cow. He has one, so he. He has one left. 
not dead yet. Good God. I almost thought he was going to. He should have been. Uh, I might as well attack back if he's going to look at his profile right now. Three attacks, four is to hit, uh, two hits, and three is to wound. Inclusive, and one wound. Are you negative? Nope. Yeah. Alright, we save. Okay, uh, your turn. Okay, this dude's attacking. Come on, boards! Okay. He's not attacking. All right, horrors. Let's do like he did last time. Because <laughs> that was epically cool for me and non-cool for you. Nope. Nope. <laughs> no heads? Nope. Yes. Nope. Do you have any guys left? Uh, Those yes. guys against the These letters, right? Against the letters. Yep. I think they might kill them. Hang on. I'm thinking they will. Two attacks each. Two, four, six, eight, ten. It's eleven. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Threes and threes. If I roll my sixes, they are mortal wounds. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, they're dead. Huh? That's a mortal wounds. There are two, four, six mortal wounds right there. Yeah, they're dead. Yeah. <laughs> just, just pull. I like those guys. Two guys left. Uh, two wounds. They need to die. All right. The only thing I've left is the uh, cannon. So let's do the maw. The maw, maw. Yeah, let's do the maw first. This sounds. He's gonna gum you. No, no, no. Miss. Well, did the same thing. And <laughs> one hit. Blades. Oh, crap. I need it. And it wounds at negative one. Negative one. Yeah. And he saves. Okay. That's it. Okay, my turn. No, no, it's bad. no, no, no. 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 Run checks. Now it's initiative. We're doing run checks, run checks. Run checks. Oh, that's right, run checks. Run checks. Nobody died here. <laughs> uh, pink cores lost some people. Pink cores lost three. So that they don't, they won't run because you can't get a 10. Right. They lost three, but I can't. And he didn't, he didn't lose, lose any. any. So they didn't lose any. They just took wounds. They actually lost one guy. Uh, yeah. Good, good. Although, let's re roll that. What? Let's re roll that. Oh. Like, oh, no. they got an instrument going. No. <laughs> no. I, I, so yeah, you probably won't run. But you're going to re roll that one, damn it. Make me re roll. Okay, now. It is initiative. Initiative fast up. Six. Dang it. <laughs> Matt wins the initiative again. I have not won initiative yet. <laughs> Do you have any powers to invoke? Yeah, I, I, I definitely can invoke lots of powers. Uh, I might as well just invoke. Well, no. He oh, has special powers, and there's lots of enemies within six inches of him now. How can I lose every initiative? <laughs> uh, kind of fun fire. Okay, cool, awesome. So, casting six. Oh, is he actually casting? Yeah. All right. Eight. I am going to try to deny from him. And you're barely with an 18. We figured that out last turn. No. Oh. Now the witch hunters can also deny. Yeah. No, the witch hunters, if they're the target, oh, they're the target. on a right. six, they ignore the effect. That's right. Okay, so uh, I'm going to roll two d6, and each enemy within six inches of the caster suffers d3 mortal wounds if their bravery is less than total roll. <laughs> now what? <laughs> Oh, I rolled five! Five. Your bravery is all better than five, right? Yes. Yeah. I lose one for what? You, you would suffer D3 mortal, mortal wounds. Just above my bravery. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> See, that's what I wanted. A 10. Bad, that would be bad. Yeah, those were the shots. For every unit within six inches? Wow. That could have been bad. Uh, only have two, guys. two units. I'm sure this guy probably. Yeah, okay. but you know, six inches from his tip of his sword. Yeah, I'll get you. I'll give you one. <laughs> I'll give you one to go that far. <laughs> okay, so uh, moving phase. I cannot believe. All right, we're gonna cancel the moving phase. And it hits. Uh, Cannon hits. And it wounds. And it wounds. Witch hunter is gonna get hurt. And it wounds. One. One. Is there minuses? E minus two. Was it? I believe so. Something I need to remember two. these things. 
Uh, skull cannon, minus two, yep. And how many wins does it do? Does it one, one. because I rolled a one. Uh, ouch. Need to roll six. Did you do yes, six. you should, then he would fall over dead. It's all, it's all good. One, two. So, so I have six horrors in there. I gotta get, for my cast, I gotta get that skull cannon. That's pretty So let's shoot. Come on, horrors. You need me better than this. Leader. And I believe actually three does one well with them. So far, one. One normal? No, they need fours. One. Earth. Earth? Men down. All right, flamers is inch. Uh, let's just kill this baddie. Just get done with them. Have some ones. That was a four before I kicked it over, though. Three's the wound. Three's the wound. And this is where they get brutal. Three, four, five, six, seven. Seven wounds, Rico. Seven. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, I can't get to be rolling on the other chart. Oh, well. Okay. How many? Seven. Seven, no minuses? On him. Yep, no minuses. Six, seven. Bye bye, baby. Bye bye. All right. Ow. Ouch. That's it. What's that? They're in combat, right? Yeah. Sure. So I guess now it's uh, assault phase. Any charges? Okay. Well, since he's about to die, let's uh, go ahead and kill him. Finish him. Finish him. Uh, that should be one. Any minuses? Because I did need... No, three's to hit. It's always three's to hit with him. Okay. Two wound. Threes. One wound with a minus one. Two damage. So two at negative one. Two at negative one. It takes one. Okay, now these guys need threes. And they need fours. One. At, that's actually one that does three damage at negative two. The sword actually did something. Yikers. Three damage at negative two? Three damage at negative two. Wow. Or, or two damage at negative two. Two damage at negative two. Angel, go bye bye. Alright, your turn. Okay. Well, he is going to try to call down lightning on that dude. Oh, no. What? Okay. Oh, we're assault. I thought I said my turn. Oh, sorry. Uh, your turn to attack back. You're a assault step. Okay, I apologize. No, you're good. I took it wrong. I was you're good. over in zone line on here. But... Yes, he's not going to call down lightning. I love the lightning spell because it's so brutal, but I hate it because it's been killing me okay. really effectively. <laughs> Um, <laughs> this is dumb. I don't like. I, it's just gonna die. So I want to attack something with it, but do why? it. Cause I want to do something else. So hey, Rico, I will promise you, if you attack with that guy, my next attack will be with these guys. That way, I don't rob you of anything else. Or he attacks. Because right. Matt's such a nice guy. <laughs> oh, he actually hit me. <laughs> Can you please wound. Please wound. Yes! One normal wound. <laughs> and they'll take it. And they're wow. still fighting. Island? Does he have any overwatch? Oh, yes, Steeds. Fours. Okay. Uh, fours. So three normals. That's pretty impressive. He's dead. Oh. <laughs> uh, one of them has a wound, though. Just like that. Yep. Let me go grab my dad. Mark. Just shoot this thing. Because he did his last deed. Mark. Okay. Now it's your turn again. All right. Turn to attack. Now it's your turn to have a turn. My turn to do anything else. Turn to attack. <laughs> right. Okay. We're going to do that. We're going to pile in. Okay. Kill him now. Yeah. I don't hope I am. Finish it. Okay. They are all attacking him. Two, four, six, eight, plus one. Because these guys too. Nice down. 
This is your lamp? Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, Six, eight, plus one. Come on, we can kill it. We can do it, boys. We have faith in you. We have faith in you. It's just a demon. Something big. Um, wow, one. Jeez. Uh, take, Rico. Assault take. You fell? Yeah. You need to roll four. It dies. It's like back into the war. General's gone. Okay. Uh, my turn, right? Yes. Mm. Yeah, do the lamprey. Lamprey, alright. Why well, did I actually call the lamprey or is it for Screamers? It's Screamers as an inch. That's what I thought. No idea. Boars? One and nothing. Nothing. Okay, go. We will counter the lamp ray. Threes. Yes. This guy's actually doing good. All right, so that's two hits at negative one. Uh, six up. And he's dead. Lamprey dies. So this side of the board is mine. This side of the board is yours. <laughs> Funny how that works out. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do the three inch pile in. You can stand on the base for. Because the base doesn't matter. It only holds up the model. Let's do its mauve. Oh, the maw actually the maw hits. Actually hits. The maw actually hit. I wasn't expecting it to hit. His maw. His little mouth. <laughs> All right, so three to one. No! Oh, no wound. Dang, the my head, but doesn't. And the Blades of Doom. Can you roll some sixes? No. Nope. They all hit. But I will hit. And, yeah, all wounds. All wounds. And nope. negative one. Negative ones. <sighs> Two guys, wow. Blam! Do you have anything else? Um, or is it just my pink core, or is that this point? That. Yeah, I don't have anything else for him. So get that three inch paralyzed, and let's do what we did last time, boys. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. Hit, nothing wound. Nothing hit? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go, those guys kind of do suck in hand. Yeah, they do. They're definitely not as bad. Okay. Well, they're just as bad. <laughs> <laughs> now we got to roll runaways, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. 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 Oh! Ouch. Okay, explain to our viewers what's happening. All Six right. plus... So, here's the bad part. Six plus two. I lost two guys. So I do six plus the two guys, whatever you roll, plus the two guys. And then you look here. There's eight. Uh -huh. I'll show you. So you would look here at their bravery, which is six. Whatever that number is over their bravery, that many guys run away. So, so six plus two is eight, minus six is two, so you lose two, two guys. guys. just run away. Two guys them. run off the board. Ouch. That was painful there. All right. Your horrors probably didn't lose enough or anything, right? No. They didn't lose enough, so. They lost one, which. That's or it. two, actually, I think. They lost two. Yeah, they lost two. Okay. Okay. Oh, the 10 of bravery of the turn. my turn. Yes, it is. This may be the last turn. Maybe. Just based on what I don't have. <laughs> this I got four be... units, Rico. Let's do this. I cannot summon my chain lightning. Yeah! Because you are too far away. So, hero phase and magic phase done. You're not gonna move. Movement phase, let's pause. These guys are gonna run. So, over these guys are all running to try to get back because I pretty much own this side of the board now and Matt owns this side of the board now. So, we're gonna meet in the middle. So, we're gonna try to take him out here. So, cannons are gonna shoot at his cannon. Uh -oh. so his cannon shoots. Whoa! whoa. Hits both times, wounds both times, doing a total of three wounds at negative two. Negative two, my save is four, so I need sixes. And I roll twos. Pump, pump. We'll kick that over to a three. He cannot he will have see left. the cannon, so he's going to shoot the pink horrors. Horrors! 
and miss. Well, shot. This guy is not hit once. That guy can't there. see this? Huh? That cannon couldn't see this? It, it, I guess it can see that much of it. Still missed. So, same, same, either way. same in result, yes. I was going to say, you need to hire right. that crew. Right. <laughs> These guys, I know, they have not hit a thing. These guys are checking their hammers again down there. Make sure he doesn't need glasses. <coughs> and I think they benefit they from the building, right? Better. Hammer, 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 hammer. Checking some hammers. Yes, that would be three. No negatives or anything. Okay, five ups. And I get two. Take one. You guys wound, so he will go. Don't worry, we're on them down. Alright. Uh, I'm used to picking guy. all those up in one go normally. It's kind of nice. <laughs> He's milling the model off the table. Last guy is going to shoot that pink horror. Because from the tip of his gun to the tip, tip of, of his your finger was a nice. my champion! Alright. One hit. It does D3, right? Yep, one wound. D3, please. It does one. one. At negative one. Negative one, one, it's six. Whoa, fail! This guy is going to shoot the cannon. Because a little pistol does lots of things to big cannons. It's going to hit once. And he's not going to wound. He's going to wound, and he's going to do one. one wound at negative one. Negative one. Five up. He's fine. Saves. That is my shooting phase. We will now... Assault! Charge! Charge. I really don't have anything that can at this point. So he can run in. The witch hunter just totally wants to run in the cannon. No, he wants to stand back there and shoot. <laughs> like, no, he wants to stand back there and shoot. Uh, we are done. So anybody who lost somebody that could still run. Uh, no, they didn't lose no. enough. And, and that's so, it. Initiative. All right. I rolled a one. Oh come on! <laughs> come on! If I roll a if one, if you roll one, I'm gonna. Oh, I won an issue. It's because you finally killed my guy. <laughs> oh, that was very painful. All right. So we are going to now be able to cast Chain Lightning. What is it again? Chain Lightning. <laughs> One more time. No. Oh, we did it. Do you have you any denials? It? Do you have any magic users? Uh, no. Okay. No. Okay. So they take D3 mortal wounds. They take two mortal wounds. Two more two wounds. And on a six, it splashes over to the can. Cannon. Take it on a six. No! It is not this time. My luck of six. No chain on that lightning. That is my magic. Yeah, I'd rather take mortal wounds on a unit like that versus a big guy. Because it's just more painful on so big guys. My movement, these guys, he's going to just come up here. These guys are going to run, so they get their They're going to run! Two on run this away! We're going to pause for the move phase. Hanger. Dudes, it's you. Seems like I just did this. The guys on the tower are throwing hammers. You did just do this. Do this. Throwing some hammers again. And a little bit of hammerage. And that'd uh, be three wounds on them. And finally the ladies are down. Alright. Shooting the pink horrors. One hits. It does not wound. And shooting the pink or shooting the tank. Both hits. Both wound. Doing three, four wounds. Four wounds. Oh, four, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Four wounds. Well, does D three. So. Oh, D three. Not six. Three wounds. D three on three wounds. Three wounds. Three wounds. Negative. negative one. Negative one. Five up. So I'll take one. There we go. Okay. And three left. Cannons. This cannon is going to shoot my cannon. Your cannon. And it's going to hit, finally, in this game. It won't wound. Once. And it's going to wound. Yes, it is. And it wounds two times at a minus two. One, there's two. And I'm still alive. And this cannon shoots. Ooh, double yeah, hits. Seriously. Double hits. <laughs> now it's going to roll snakey. Probably. Oh, oh, two wounds. Two wounds. And does <laughs> six. That's probably going to die here. That's pretty good, though. Six. Fell one of them. 
And I do. I only passed two. Plunk. And that is my shooter phase. I do not have anything still yet to charge. So I am done. All right, movement phase for me. I got one. So you're doing turbo, basically. Oh, man. We haven't been rolling on the light. Chaos support. These guys fine. I'm not shutting off for the movement phase anymore. <laughs> not as much to It's sure enough now. It's not worth it. Yeah, Run. 2d6. So I'm gonna be three inches away. Three inches away already. They can run and charge in the same phase. That's awesomely cool. Alright, so my shooting phase. Let's do some three pink horrors. Three hits. He gets to return it, by the way. Okay. And then two wounds. Any minuses? Nope. Ouch. Yeah. Goodbye, Witch Hunter. I killed him! Woohoo! I should have saved him for something else. Let's see. Can I see him? No, I cannot. But I can see them. And since that's not my commander, <laughs> they don't get any bonus for being in that tower. That was some terrible. Bad roll. Well, oh, they're a pie, so you know. <laughs> One, that's Ooh, three. So that that's three. Three? Three at negative. One. Three? No, at no negative. Just three? Just three. Yep. I saved them all. Oh, well, see, there you go. Um, but it does the weird hellfire thing, right? At the end of your. No, you have to take a wound. Oh, I actually have to take a wound. Yeah. Um, so, okay, now charging phase. Let's see uh, if I roll a 12. Good. And you could do it. Actually, you might need a little. You don't have to get a half inch. I need to roll 11. That's not it. Okay. My turn's done. All right. Now it's initiative. Initiative. Oh, come on. Six. 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 <laughs> Five. I roll a three. All right. So, magic is first. I doubt he's in range of anything. No, he's in range. He's in range. For no reason. He is casting Chain Lightning! No, he's not. <laughs> but his head blows up and he does. Wow, that's sad. Okay. And that's it for that. So they're going to move. They're going to run. No, no. It's five. Five is leadership checker table. He just takes them over. He's gonna run. Four and three are the fairly safe ones. Six is great. He's gonna move. Six is great. And they're staying there. Hammers. All right, drop some hammers. A little below average on the hammer throwing. <laughs> And <laughs> pull out nothing. Nothing. Okay, shooting some gunnage. <laughs> and one. Pull out nothing. Shooting some cannon. Two hits. And one woundage. Does three hits on them. <laughs> and this cannon's got not. I can't save negative two. They're only saving the five. I still got nothing to charge. Alright. Move. Three inches out. It's a big clash in the middle of the board, huh? Shooting phase! My flamers are going to shoot your witch hunter because I don't like him. Man, I can't hit it worth any more. No. <laughs> Whopping two hits. Two hits on him. Right. There, it takes a hit. 
All right, charging. Let's so see what the flamers can do. Five. Well, is that the end of your yeah. shooting phase, right? Yeah. So don't they do the, when you took a wound? Oh, yeah, let me do that. Yep. And you suffer two mortal, two mortal wounds. Wow, he's going to be dead in a second, right? And then the keepers. Or not keepers, seekers. All right. How do I want to resolve this? Do my seekers against her guys. These are the tongues. Ooh, I'll hit. And then two wounds. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, okay. And then these are the rending claws. Let me make another attack. Good. And two wounds. These ones are negative one. All right, go. All right. Um, we'll attack those dudes. So we're three-inch pile in here. Two, four, six. Flamer attacks two. And these sixes, we do some awesome mortalness with these things. So on your That's the six. Four mortal wounds. Four mortal wounds. I would kill them. Six. <laughs> hammers are nasty. Okay, your turn. Hey, the flamers. They get two text piece. <laughs> Fives. <laughs> and then threes. One. Oh, we have Alright, that's it. So now back to initiative. Oh. Yes. Turns it so fast now. Two Matt's got it. Alright, well, I'm not gonna move, but I'm gonna shoot. <laughs> go figure, right? There we go. That's what Vince wanted me to do. Shoot the wrong guys. Three wounds. I got a conclusive here. D3. And what other one got hit? 14. No negatives. Shooting. 14. No negatives. 14. Bing flamers. If they hit, they do good. If they don't hit, they don't be so good. 14. That's going to be real light. Okay, I'm going to roll Not too bad, actually. Yep, that was it. So, four. So that's one dies. And that guy's got two. Alright, now it's my charging. Oh, 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 let me roll the. Uh... I'm going damage. Ho oh, ho! Nasty. Ho oh, ho! Three mortal wounds! Three mortal wounds? Yeah. Six and six is three mortal wounds. Well, I want my main dude to still be alive, so. That was horrible. Alright, now we're gonna charge the main dude. We'll see. Nope, three inches. I don't get you. Your turn. Wow. Okay, so. That was painful. We are going to attempt to do chain lightning. It goes off. Chain lightning! It does D3 mortal wounds. I can do it here. I'd be one. <laughs> or not. And you don't even kill a single flamer. They have two. So, that's right. Alright, now we're gonna move. Oh, wait, he has to take his. I think because his unit, he lost three guys from his unit. Oh, leadership and test, that's right. Or hero work. So he's good. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so he's gonna move. Bravery test. That's the one, bravery test. That'll be at the three inches of you, so that is there. And he's gonna move three inches from you, so that is there. Be interesting. You're not gonna cannon me? But I am after I move. Oh. Okay, those guys are gonna stay there. So, shooty phase. Still up in range. Throwing hammers? Throwing some hammers. Some hammer. 
So that's his wound. He needs that. Throwing hammers has not been my greatest. Ooh, two wounds. Two wounds. Hammers. Five up. Nope. Okay. Ow. Cannon him. First cannon. We'll hit once. And it will wound. And it will do five. Bam. And that. <laughs> Was that? <laughs> that is the a win for the empire and the celestial. With the not the a whole lot left. Pretty much the cannons <laughs> and some birdie men. <laughs> <laughs> so Matt, what do you think? Yeah, it's fun. Do you, do you think you might play it again? Yeah, I'll see why not. Do you think you'll buy a dozen more models to put into your army? No. I don't think he needs them. <laughs> That's quite a bit. Do you think Rico will buy a dozen more models to put in his army? Yes. <laughs> it's Rico. Let's be honest. Yeah. Wow, that was, that was devastatingly awesome. Well, there, are viewers. Surprisingly balanced. Well, that's very close, wasn't it? Yeah. For a random no points value card to figure out what to put on the table against whatever else. The only thing I couldn't really deal with was the cannons, effectively. But, yeah. other than that. That was the one thing I had a hard time with when I played against my chaos against Chad. He had the cannons. Was getting cannons were good. They were, they were the one that they ended up beating me. Yeah. Alright, let's wrap this up. Flip it over here. Stare at the camera. Thank you, viewers, for tuning in tonight. Comment, subscribe below, and we'll see you again soon. Try some Age of Sigmar. Try some Age of Sigmar. Thanks. Sporty K Amateur Hour. Good night. <laughs>